The attitude with the graduates is very much they expect us to be moving into senior management. We start off, we do three months of training and then we do six, three six month placements uh, in different areas of industry. Within each placement you can also get involved in various sub-departments. Um, so I've had a very varied experience, a wide skills base I've developed over the two years that I've been on the programme. Um, and quite an attractive CV from it as well. They'll get three or four placements in different parts of the business. But absolutely, so we're talking real customer facing roles, so a lot of graduates will spend six months um, working at a customer, it could be anywhere in the country, and then another, with a different customer for this, the second project. So it's a great way to build their network, given the experience of different customers. At the end of the graduate program, you'll, you'll put into a, um, into a department where you'd hold down a full-time role. Uh, as is the nature of the work we do, you're very rarely doing the same thing day in, day out. Some people choose to be technical specialists where they uh, develop skills in one area and you know, become a resource that people really depend on. Other people like to move around, learn as much about the business, about the industry as possible. Some will specialise, some will decide to go, for instance, down the IT consultancy profession route. Um, others may take a, a broader view and that's the great thing about working for IBM is you can reinvent yourself every two to three years so you can start off in a consultancy role and if you then wanted to go into to sales or, or HR or comms wherever you want to go IBM will support you to, to pursue that career. We also try and actively get them um, involved in chartered institutes as well like the IOP um, the IET and things like that so they can get themselves chartered. What the FDM Academy aims to do is really answer that catch-22 situation by providing a bridge from university through to employment. So really the world is their oyster after they've completed that two years commercial experience and they can go off to do various different things within the IT sector. I think the grad students are very good at doing that transition between university and work. Um, because you still feel you know you can move around the company and you're always told you're there to get experience not to really add something to the company I mean, obviously they want something but I mean it's really for your development for you to get experience so I think as long as you're in a good grad scheme I think um, you'll always get that support and you won't feel too much culture shock really